Hello all you young whippersnappers, this is Papa Cheddar here with ADD Gaming, bringing to you our, what is it, our 8th episode of Dark Souls? That's crazy. I don't know, I know that I'm saying that like every single episode, but to me it's nuts, like, you know, this is, these are my first, my very, very, very first uh, episodes of anything ever, and like, I don't know, for me this is wild, like, you know, it's insane, like, I don't know, I never... I never really imagined that I'd be, like, this dedicated to it, and the fact that I am makes me really happy. Like, I don't know. I know a lot of people do it, but I'm just kind of shocked that I am. Not shocked in, like, a bad way. More sh more so shocked, like, like, wow, I'm really doing this. Like, this is something I've wanted to do for a while, and I'm doing it. Like, it's cool. Uh, it makes me feel good about myself, and I really enjoy playing this game just in general. Or playing games on a channel in general. Like, it, I don't know, it's something magical about it. Like... Granted, some games I do want to play on my own, but there's definitely, like, a, I don't know, not I wouldn't say shimmer, but, like, a, a special feeling that goes along with playing games and other people enjoying watching you do it. Like, it, there's, there's enjoyment in being an entertainer. Like, I don't know. It feels nice. It really just feels nice. Night ahead. All right, I can deal with the night. Down through this doorway. If we walk slowly, we can get the jump on him and give him a good old backstab. Very good. There we god. No, there we go. Good old backstab right there, right through the back of the head. Not through the back of the head, through the back of the torso. Obviously, I wasn't very good at, not physics, anatomy. Anatomy at science in general because I can't even think of the right names for each thing. I don't know. Today's been a long day. Like, a really long day. Like, I really just kind of want to sleep, but, like, it's only, like, 4 o'clock. I feel like sleeping at 4 o'clock is frowned upon. That, and I haven't done this yet, and I like doing this, so I'm going to do it. Hopefully that Red Knight guy doesn't, like, come up here. Because, like, I, I pulled him out of his tower, which is over yonder. It's, like, back a little ways. But then I, like, had to haul ass all the way back up to... And to haul ass all the way back up to the bonfire up by where the blacksmith is to get away from him because he's terrifying. Like I'm not sure if you guys have fought him yet, but he's he's not you know, he's not a guy to, to fuck around with. Like he's a force to be reckoned with. So reckon him reckon him greatly and don't take him lightly because he'll mess you up. You won't even think twice about it. He'll just be like, Yo man, I don't like what you're saying. I don't like the words you'd be spouting off at me. I'll just take you out. I'll just take you out right now. And then he'll do it. Like, you won't even think about it. won't even hesitate. Um, anyways, I was thinking that we would, like, grind a little bit. I'm not, you know, buy, like, a tan tantite shard so that we can upgrade uh, our armor. And then after that, we would go and try to fight Mothra again. Because last time, you know, we did okay. We just didn't have enough Estus. We needed more Estus to be the bestest, and we weren't the bestest because of our lack of Estus, so, you know, that's all that I can do for rhyming in a nutshell, but, you know, that's, uh, that's pretty much where I'm going with that, you know, like, I want to, I want to be the very best, the best there ever was, and a balder glove, do I have pretty gloves? Maybe I'll have to switch my gloves, maybe the balder gloves are worth it, maybe they're not, we'll find out momentarily. Or what we could do is we could do something else, which I actually think that we might wind up doing. In fact, I'm going to go do it right now, and I'll show you guys what the other thing is. And if we have enough time, maybe we'll try to take down the Moonrise Butterfly one more time. I really don't like the butterfly, though. It kind of pisses me off, and it scares me. Um, blacksmith ahead. Blacksmith. I thought that it said Black Knight. I was like, no, I'm pretty sure I killed him. He isn't ahead. Can't be ahead because he's dead, and if you're dead, you're not ahead because, you know, I don't know, maybe you got decapitated. Now you don't have a head no more. But who knows, maybe that's just my way of seeing it. Maybe you're just not ahead because you're no longer living, so you can't, like, you know, beat other people and things. I don't know. Maybe you're ahead because you're in heaven. Who knows? I don't know how it works, people. I just, I'm just talking really fast at you. And I'm hoping that you like it because, you know, if you do like it, then that's, like, half my job. The other half is to play the game, which I'm genuinely bad at. So I like imagining that I'm good at one of them. Yeah, I could use some things forged. Um... Purchase item. Hmm, let's look around. Broadsword. Let's see what it does. Broadsword has regular attacks. I like slashing. Pretty sure that's what mine does. Let's check. Be 
Like, slashing is honestly one of the only things that I'm good at doing, which is why I like the Black Knight Sword so much, because it's, like, the only other weapon that I've ever found that is effective at slashing. Uh, you know, besides, like, axes and stuff. Yeah, curve sword, attack type, slash. Um, the Gargoyle Tail Axe. I'm not really strong enough to wield it yet, so there's no point in trying. Uh, yes, I need things. Uh, repair equipment, purchase item, purchase item, hmm. I wonder if there are any shields which have, like, magic resist. I know, ooh, okay, yeah, never mind, never mind, never mind. Um, purchase, I know I'm just saying a lot of things really fast, and some of them aren't coherent, but I'm, like, my brain's going in, like, 12 different directions, and, uh, it's not, it's not panning out the best for me mentally, but, you know, I'm trying. I'm trying. Where is the Phoenix helmet? What does that need? Twinkling Tantite. Tantite? Tantite. Mm, let's go with the Balder Glove. Nah, let's check to see what our hand guards are at. It's at 16 going up to 18. Balder Gloves would be at 18, but they weigh 5. What do they weigh? They weigh weight. Let's go with it. Whatever. Alright. Alright, so let's... Alright, whatever. You be quiet. I don't want to talk to you. Maybe you're going to say something important. I don't know, but I'm not waiting to find out. So, there's like a one pound difference. I'm sure that that won't change like our entire movement speed. And if it does, I'm going to be really depressed. I can still roll like 20 times, so I'm happy with life. Rolling 20 times is like essential for this game. I don't know. Rolling's important. Guarding's important too. Like I've recently found that out. I, I personally think that I'd be a whole lot better at the game before if I had guarded more, which I never did. But that explains why. Like I don't know. I feel like it took me a whole lot longer to do everything, and like I don't know. I was, I was never at the right level for anything. But like in a bad way, not like. You know, ooh, look at me, I'm like level four and a half, and I took down like, you know, I don't know, the freaking gargoyles. Like, that didn't happen. That never happened. Never happened in a good way for me. It happened in a bad way for me, and that was kind of disappointing. Kind of made me sad. Uh, if I remembered correctly, there was a guy who was supposed to chase us. Be wary of back. I will. Yeah, yeah, because there's a guy who's supposed to, like, chase us down. I guess he wasn't there. Uh, and then you go down here. We might fail at the thing that I want to do, by the way. Last time I did it, like, I came out on top but it was it was you know magical that i managed to come out on top i didn't think that i would so we'll find out we'll find out uh dark root basin dark root basin leads to a lot of important things it's kind of not important on its own but it does lead to a lot of very important locations and that's why i come here uh that guy's important too you want to kill him and then eat him like he's important um well, you don't actually eat him, but he drops something that's really good. And I think the guy who I want to fight is down here. I might be wrong. I'm normally wrong. Maybe he's over here? I think he's over here. Be wary of the night. Praise the sun. Where? There's no sun here, you frickin' idiots. Some of the people who play this game are just dumb as rocks. Like, the whole praise the sun thing is because this game is so dark and depressing. This this is a dark and depressing location. Alright, um, let's go. We took down your brother. Alright, so this guy's not nearly as effective as the Red Knight, so I'm not really afraid of him. Except I haven't been able to get any damage off. So, I don't know. Maybe if we, like, rinse and repeat. Come on, get some health back. Heal up. Guard, guard. Ooh, very close. Let's just circle around, hit. Oh. Didn't get our shield up in time. The other thing is, with this this area in particular, you want to make sure that you don't fall off of it. 
Alright, so we're going to want to get back. Oh, God, he got us. He got us hard. Alright, so that is the Green Knight, I think. I think he's the Green Knight, because when you kill him, you get a shield that says the Green Knight shield. Um, we aren't, however, talented enough to compete with his class, nor are we talented enough to fight the Red Knight, so I think that we're just going to have to hold off on it. I don't know. I guess, like, when I fought him last time, I, like, haul up... Eh, I did some damage, then I, like, hauled up like over a ridge and then I jumped off of the ridge and he followed me and I healed and I think the fall damage did most of the damage on him like the first time I played this game a lot of really dumb and wonky things happen I'm kind of disappointed that some of them haven't happened now but I don't know I've been trying to play smart maybe I've been maybe I should try to play dumber I love destructible terrain by the way like that's it's just such a fun little touch it makes the game so much more enjoyable so while he's winding up I'll just take the opportunity to cut his legs off he doesn't actually have legs I'll just cut off his arms uh, but if I remember correctly and I know that I say that term a lot and I wind up never remembering correctly uh, then I should go this way get the kill off on the big butterfly guy and then there should be something waiting for us. And I'm starting to think that I should have saved up some of the, those souls and just grinded it out to get the uh, to get the crest that we need to open up the gate. Uh, there's a gate over here. If I didn't explain that to you last episode, I'll explain it to you now. Uh, basically, there's a gate up ahead that opens up a whole new area, but you need... Uh, a crest that the blacksmith can forge for you to open up the gate and you can't find it like I've tried to find it maybe you can maybe I just suck and I haven't found it yet but you need a crest to open up this gate and otherwise it just stays shut and this doesn't lead to the same place at all like don't fool yourself don't think that it does because it doesn't uh, so we're just gonna try to like stealth on by that area because they'll kick our butts uh, Well, they're following us anyways. Alright, so we'll have to rock like like one Estus. No, like four Estus. I, I'm lying. I'm bad at the game. And at talking, apparently. Like, that was my strong suit. Now it's not. I don't know. As soon as I get into combat, I just sort of like shut down vocally. And I'm like, bah, what do I say? Um... But what I should be saying is, oh my gosh, I'm getting my butt whooped by these low-tier pieces of garbage because I'm bad at the game. And uh, now I'm going to be, like, running through here, trying to get up here. I'm just going to run around him because he's terrifying. Like, you want to hit him when he gets up with a really strong weapon. My weapon is decently strong. It's not nearly as strong as it should be to fight him, though, so I'm not going to attempt it. Um, at least not yet. Not while I'm trying to kill the butterfly because I need all the health that I can get. Uh, most of her attacks, though, you just need to, like, know when to roll. So, and I think that you have to, like, gank her over here. I don't know, she likes to perch over here on these sparkly parts. She likes the sparkly bits. Keep looking at me, lady. All eyes on me in the center of the ring, just like a circus. Ow. Oh, God. Holy shit. Sorry. Sorry for my vulgarity. We'll try that one more time, just because I really want to kill her. And that was dumb. Like, I don't know, last time I fought her, it was nowhere near that bad. And, like, when I would roll, I don't know, maybe I just rolled wrong or something. Maybe I gotta be closer to the edge, but... I don't know, I was able to dodge it last time, and this time she just, like, came at me, like, guns blazing, and I died. I don't know, that was disappointing. Like, if you guys have seen the last video, I actually got her down to, like, half health before she wound up killing me. And, uh, I don't think that those sparkly orb ways, I don't think that was how she did it. I think that she got me with the needles. Um... Maybe I should try using the shield against those. I don't think that'll be as effective as I want it to be, though. So, I'm not, I'm not sure if that'll pan out correctly. Like, I need some sort of magicka shield, like, something that will defend me from magic. And, uh, I don't, I just don't have something like that. Oh god, you're alive? How are you alive? Maybe my, my sword must be damaged? I don't know. 
Uh, we'll find out soon. Like, two hits should normally kill those guys. Uh, next time I die, I'll, I'll fix it. But right now, we're already in it. I don't want to take the time out. Oh, there we go. I don't know. Maybe it was just some rare type. I guess maybe that guy just innately has more health. Maybe my first swing just kind of sucked and pinged off of him. Uh, but who knows? Who knows? Yeah, see, it didn't do as much that time, too. Maybe the purple ones have more health. I don't know. That guy was purple, too, so, I mean, I don't know. Maybe, like, if my theory is correct, then it shouldn't have worked out that way. <coughs> but, yeah, Moonlight Butterfly, definitely a terrifying boss. Uh, the first time I played against it, I had no idea how to, how to fight it because it was just, like, up in the air, and I was like, meh, it's flying. What do I do to stop flying? And then it would come down, and I'd be like, oh, okay, that's how you do it. Um, that isn't how my first time went, though. Like, my first time was a whole lot more hit hit or miss. Like, it was like... It was like, I'm probably going to die from this, and I know it. Um, oh, God, what the... Anybody see the game screaming over right there? Alright, and then the pretty moss, like, like the uh, flowery one, I'm pretty sure that gives you, like, both of, like, it makes you immune to poison, makes you immune to, like, bleeding. Not immune, but it, like, cures it, you know, it doesn't let you take that stuff, and it's like, you know, there ain't no hollaback girls, you ain't gonna take none of that crap. I hate those poisony vine tree thingies, they're scary and they blend in like shockingly well for a video game like i don't know i've never seen a video game where they made an enemy block and so blend in so well but they did it really well in this game so that's pretty cool i don't think that he'll come after me up here but i don't want to find out so let's just keep moving we'll use an estus at the top of the stairs before we get into the combat but if my talking kind of sucks in there i apologize but i have a good reason and that good reason is i'm trying to avoid dying um Let's get our, like, what, a thousand souls, maybe? Uh, less, less, like, six hundred, six hundred souls. Um. Ow. Don't have a say. Oh my god. Oh, she's butchering me. She's butchering me so good. Fortunately, you don't actually have to fight this lady. I'm just choosing to because I suck at life and am bad at fighting. Uh, we should probably go and do something else. That's my census on the matter. So we're going to go downstairs and find some dragons. What do you think? Uh... Let's see if anything is damaged first. I mean, there's nothing that I can do about it, but I can check. Reinforce weapon, not reinforce weapon. Repair equipment. Yeah, this is all damaged. Not by much, though, so we'll be fine. Um, hmm. Alright. So, I think this is just a string of people saying I did it. I did it. I did it try luring it out. Hey, that guy was different. That's nice. Um, Alright, let's go. I think, like, the first time I went through there, I just tried to, like, balls to the wall sprint out of there, and it didn't work out, because there's no sprint button in this game, which I now know. I now know that. Thank you, Internet, for not telling me. Um, I'm just kidding. But, let's go down here. We'll avoid the black knight guy because he's not our friend and i don't like him like one bit like he is not a friendly camper and i know friendly campers i'm a camp counselor so you know friendly campers are my like they're my forte you know like i like i like the friendly campers are nice people they're not mean people and i don't mean i like them in a weird way you know and i'm not some strange guy who's like into kids that's it's bizarre and if you think that that's my sort of stuff then you're on the wrong channel you should probably leave be wary of tough enemy. There is one tough enemy. All of the other ones suck. Do not lie to me, game. I know. I know your tricks. I know your tricks, internet. Don't lie to me. 
Uh, so I think you're supposed to shoot him with a bow. That's what I did last time. Uh, or with, like, I don't know, magic. I don't do magic, though. I'm not a very magic -y person. I should probably pick up some, though, because it is important. Like, it's a very... It's a critical part of the game, which I have decided not to learn for one reason or another. Leather armor, that's right. All right, that's cool. Let's let's compare. Leather is weaker, but oh well, my pants are upgraded. I'll upgrade it soon, and then they'll be like you know on more leveled playing grounds uh playing grounds yeah playing fields i don't know something like that fields grounds who needs either of them um now if i go down there but i think i need to get past the night to get there then i can get to an important place but if i go up here there's some hydra to shoot who like shoot shit at you and i don't really want to fight him and you can't really actually get to him for a little while there's also a doorway but i feel like the guy in there has a better chance of whooping our ass than the guy over here so i mean i don't know this is our best bet this is our best bet so that's what we're gonna do it's like our only chance this is my only whatever this is my last resort i um hop Ah, uh, grass crest shield, that's what it was. Ah, into here. Will he come in here? He won't come in here. Alright, let's light this bonfire. Because this one's going to be important. Uh, then we're going to change our shield to the Grass Crush Shield, because the Grass Crush Shield does some stuff, if I remember correctly. It defends better against magic. It's worse physically, but that's only because I haven't upgraded it. Uh, Lightning Fire, yeah, it's much it's much better. It's much better. And it heals you. I forgot about that. It has like this innate healing ability that while you're using it, it just heals you. So it's like your best friend. Uh, let's not lie. I don't have many friends, and I need this one. Where did he go? Like, that was creepy. Oh, there he is. Although, I did say <laughs> that it's worse at guarding physical... Shield up. Oh, nope. Yeah, I got him. Whew, blue Tantite Trunk. That was terrifying. That guy's scary. He is not a friendly customer. Uh, okay, so maybe he wasn't the green knight or whatever like I thought he was, but... Oh, wait, maybe... No, this is stamina up. It's a stamina up boost. It's not a It's not a health up boost. Ha ha ha, I'm an idiot. Um, anyways, it's like one of my favorite shields. It's very good. Um, and we should probably go over here, heal up, and then we'll try and go up and deal with a guy who pisses me off more than, like, anything else in the game. Not anything else, actually. Things around here piss me off more than anything else in the game. Um... Actually, I don't think we have enough time, so we're going to cut it off here. This has been our eighth episode of Dark Souls, so thank you for tuning in, and I hope all of you young whippersnappers have a fantastic day. Please leave a comment down below if you enjoyed the video. I just like hearing you know, what everyone has to say. Thanks, and have a great one. This is Papa Cheddar signing off.